Hi, welcome or welcome back to the channel. If this is your first time seeing my hands, hi, I'm Erin of Playing Life with Erin, and I'm so happy you are here with us. Thank you for stopping by and checking out this video. And if you're returning, hey, hey, how was your week? Okay, guys, so I've been holding on to all of my goodies from the Coffee Monster Co. for probably about a week and a half. Um, I have just been super overwhelmed with tons of things. Um, and I haven't had a chance to like sit down and really like dive in and I wanted to share it with you guys. So this is going to be kind of like a, like an unboxing video, I guess, or like, I'm going to share my stash with you. Um, it's not a lot. It was just a couple of orders. Like my pre-order, I think the birthday sale was in here. Um, I did get some seasonal stickers. Um, so it's not a ton, but I wanted to share a couple other things with you guys. So if you have seen um, past videos of mine, I do have a video up where I share my sticker storage and everything um, from that video is linked in my Amazon storefront. So that's where I get these um, sheets from <clears throat> and they go into sticker or the six ring binders. And I think it's an A5 size. Um, I've recently found a harder cover, um, and it has like a string so you can, um, like an elastic so it'll stay shut. Um, and this is like a hard plastic. So this came in a set of two and I believe it was $9.99 or $10.99. I will link it in my Amazon storefront, but I'm wanting to... <clears throat> excuse me, I'm wanting to give this a try. I do love these binders. I think they also come in a set of two. Um, but as you can see, we are like busting at the seams. So I thought it'd be great to try something else. I love trying out new things and then sharing them with you guys and giving you my honest opinion. So I have not used this yet. So we'll see how this works. <clears throat> Excuse me, I don't know what my deal is with my throat the last couple of days. I've been very froggy. Okay, and another thing that I was thinking about trying to do on this video, so I noticed that when I got this lovely packaging, um, we have this really cool um, plastic bag with a design, and I was thinking about laminating it and um, creating like a uh, pencil board with it. Um, so I might share that with you guys if we have enough time which I think we will, because I really don't have a ton, ton, ton to show you guys. Um, okay, so let's start with opening up my goodies because is I've waited too long, too long. Okay, so this is from, uh, let's see, this is the pre-order. This is packed by Jan, thanks Jan. Jan packed like pretty much all my orders, most of the time, she's the one that packs my orders. Okay, so let's see, freebie. Oh my gosh, I love these, get your ducks in a row. I do not have my ducks in the row. 90% of the time, I don't even know where my ducks are. Okay. Put that off to the side. And I don't know if I'm going to open all these, but I did get two of the, which ones are these? These are like Bad Day. The Bad Day Modi, I think it was. I'll have to check on the names. I did not prepare it before I hopped on. I was like, ooh, I want to open up my stuff. So I probably will open these. This is City Life or something. I don't remember the names of these. I'm so terrible, but we will open them. Let's see, this was the book one, and then I got a house cleaning one, and a cooking one. And then I accidentally got two of these, um, the town ones. I didn't mean to get two, but here we are. I am really excited about this. So we can swap out my my planner cover. I'm really excited. It matches my desk theme pretty well. I have a lot of this like, this is matcha green, I think, but I have a lot of sage green and creams and this will match great. I'm really excited to use this. Put that off to the side and I love this card. So cute. All the vegetables. Really loving this one. Okay, we'll put that off to the side. I did get this is from the birth, her birthday sale, the birthday sale that we had, so, or they had, I should say. Okay, this is a reusable sticker book. So I've actually never used one of these before. So we shall see how I like it, if I like it. Um, I might use it for vinyls, maybe. I don't know. I just kind of stick them on there so they're all in one spot. We'll see. Because I always feel like I have a, I have trouble storing like my individual stickers. 
but um, I'm a huge fan of Van Gogh and this is one of my top two favorites of Van Gogh's painting. So I really liked this and I thought it was super cute just to have that. Okay, I'll put that off to the side and then this one I'm really excited about. So let's open this. I believe this is like an A6 size probably. It's a sticker album and oh, I love that. And it does, it has like, it's kind of like this where it has like the hard plastic. And then it's just, you can slide your stickers in. Is it double-sided storage? How do we get them in? Oh, okay, over here. Well, that's nice. So there's two separate pockets, one here and then one on the other side. Super good quality. I'm liking this a lot. I just kind of need to, I might tie it shut um, because I had it for so long in the packaging, it was flat. So we will have to get that to stay closed. Okay, and I'm also gonna make a note. So I don't have, um, I put this like mouse pad down on my desk and it's kind of like a, it's a white or an off-white. So let me know what you guys think. It is a um, very gloomy day here in Rhode Island and it's Friday morning actually. And I had some time to kill before I go to the dentist. And if you're watching this, Oh, say Hail Mary for me because it's been like three years since I've gone because of the pandemic and all that stuff. And I'm just praying. I have some pain in my, um, my top right teeth, teeth, my back molars. I don't know. Um, but I also get migraines and I'm not sure if my migraines are causing the pain. Um, cause I tend to only have it when I have a migraine. Although the other night I was chewing and it didn't feel good. So I'm hoping maybe it's just one cavity that needs to be filled. I don't know, but wish me luck. Okay. This was, I think this was, oh, I ordered these. Yes. I ordered these the day before her birthday sale because I wanted to get um, some seasonal stickers for um, fall and Halloween and all those. I want to make sure I am ready to go. I might actually store some of them in this this smaller. It's not going to fit these, but that's okay. I might create one of these binders just for um, seasonal stuff, but okay. What was I doing? Okay, I went completely off topic, guys. Squirrel. All right, so before we dive into these stickers, I was talking about this background and I was saying it was a gloomy day here, but I would love to hear some feedback. Normally it is like my desk that I plan on, but I didn't feel like moving this this morning. Um, and I thought, well, might as well go with it. Let me know what you think. If you prefer the other background or this background, I don't even know if it matters to you, but um, if it does, let me know. So let's dive into these stickers. So I did the large Be Bold doodles. So cute. I'm loving these. Um, let's see what else I do. I did autumn mug doodles because pumpkin spice is already out with Dunkin' Donuts and Starbucks now. Um, usually I refrain from getting pumpkin spice, but the weather around here, it's been like low 70s, perfect, perfect fall weather, you know, in August, summer. So we'll see. Maybe I'll cut, I'll cave and I'll get myself a pumpkin spice chai. I don't know. We'll see. We shall see. Sweater weather emojis. What else did I get? Pumpkin spice, speaking of emojis. And then these, I just had to have them. Hocus Pocus. I can't wait to watch both Hocus Pocus movies in um, September, October, I guess. Oh, and this is a little freebie. How cute. I love these. Put that over there. All right, let's see. Oh, that's right. I forgot I got this kit. I did the Be Bold kit. So pretty. I'm probably going to get another one of these. This is so cute. Love these. Okay. And autumn kit. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, I did the, the deluxe kit, I guess. Where I did the three pages because I liked this washi. I love these colors for autumn. Like, I really love the orange with this turquoise color. It's a great combination for me for fall and all that. I did Cozy Halloween. Oh, that's right. I did the three. Normally, I don't do... Um, oh, no. What is this? Did I order the wrong ones? I think I ordered the wrong kit. Or maybe I didn't. Did I? Hmm. I don't think this is for... 
Okay, hold on. We'll look at that in a second. Um, normally, I don't order the three pages because I just use my own washi, but I thought this was super cute with the spider webs and all that stuff. So that is super, super cute. Very excited about those. And then I don't think I ordered the correct kit. Hmm, I'm gonna have to check on that. It's super cute, but this doesn't seem like it's a Hopanichi kit. I could be wrong. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna have to check on that one. Um, but it's super cute and I can definitely use it. So, but I do need to order a kit for September. Okay, cool. I love this. I like the like the the neutrals and all the pastries. I really love how she did like a food theme this year. Um, makes me hungry when I'm planning, but this one probably is my favorite. It's all the pastries. It's so cute. Okay. Cute, cute, cute. All right. Now. There's another one of these. How cute is that? So now I have two. I could probably use these for the front and back cover of the new photo album. Um, not photo album, sticker album that I'm going to be creating. All right, so let's see. What else did I get? Let's put this off to the side. And let's open this one. I'm going to be very, very careful when I open this. I don't want to this paper. Look how pretty that is. So I'm going to try to, if I don't do it in this video, if I don't have time, which I think we probably will, I'm going to do it in another video. But I think we'll have time in this one. Very cute. Okay, I had to have these. They're so cute. These are the wax seal stickers. I just love them. I love the colors of them. I'm really excited to use them. Let's see what I get. I love bread. <laughs> that is so true. We're like carbs and we're carboholics and salsa. I say it all the time. Um, recent orders. So cute. So maybe I will, I think I'm going to laminate this. So if I'm going to laminate that, I might as well laminate this too. And then I'll use a wet eraser marker so I can just keep reusing it. And let's see. The same freebie. I have my cat hair. Poppy's been hanging out at my desk. And then I love this one. This is one of my my favorites, I think, and I have a cork board behind me and I hang my favorites. So this one's definitely gonna go up on the cork board. Okay, and last, but definitely not least, I'm really excited about this pen holder, fountain pen holder. So let's open this. How oh, cute, really love that. Oh, and I could probably, ooh. All right, let's get my fountain pens. I have two that I use all the time. I love this one. Oh, cute. And then my Twisby. And we can just, for added fun, let's just add in this one. Ooh. Let me put this right in here. Will fit. Put the pens in there. Oh, yeah, I like that. Let's close it up. Oh, I'm so excited. That is so cute. I love it. So stinking cute. And then I can just put it in my purse or I can put it in my tote when I'm going places. Love it. Okay, cool. Okay, so I actually went and I checked on what I actually ordered. And if you've been around on the channel for a little bit, you know that sometimes I don't pay close attention to when I'm ordering things. Um, and I actually ordered for the 2023 regular monthly kits. So I could probably use this like in my, um, my weekly spread maybe if I wanted to. I did a little bit of sticker surgery and things like that, but I have definitely gone online and ordered the correct one because September is right around the corner. So I need to get that ordered. Um, or I might just have to get creative with this. Um, and see if we can make it work, which I think we can. Just a little bit of sticker surgery, but um, yeah, maybe it'll be a good video to show you guys how you can um, use this for your monthly. Okay, anyways, moving on. Let's see, let's watch some of the washi. I'm really excited about these washies. It's part of me, so I got two of some. So like this one was an accidental two, but the rest is just one. I'm okay with opening my washi and using it because use the washi, use the sticker. I try to, I try to do that. So 
Might have to watch out for kittens that might try to come when they hear the crinkle crinkle of paper. I should get a piece of paper. Let's see. What do I want to use? Um, let's pull out my Hobonichi and let's use, I think I've used the back for some swatching before. So let's see. I have not filled out any of this and that's okay. Let's do it right here on this last paper. Ooh, I love that. So cute. So, so pretty. And I'm not going to, I'm gonna pull you guys down just a little bit so you can see it better. All right, let's see. I'm not going to, um, I think that covers the pattern. Yeah, so the pattern goes from here to here and then it repeats. So let's see. This one is the cooking one. So let's see. All right. If I can find the end. There we go. So this is like a mixture of things in this video, but primarily going and looking at all the fun stuff that I got from Coffee Moscow. I was actually really, really good about staying in budget, very proud of myself. And I managed to get what I wanted and then I didn't feel um, rushed or that I bought too much or that I spent too much, although I was a little sad that I accidentally <laughs> ordered two of um, this one, but that's okay. Maybe I'll like give one away or something. All right, let's see. Find the end. I really don't feel like doing much of anything today and I'm kind of sad that I have to go to the dentist. So I wish it wasn't today because it's rainy and yucky and there was already a really bad car accident on 195 um, this morning and Joe had called me. So Joe works in Fall River. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. Joe works in Fall River and I was awake and I was watching See if I can get, let me turn down this light a little bit. I feel like it's not giving you guys a good, that might be a little bit better. How's that? That seem better? Can you see that better? I think, because it's a little um, shimmery. So I'll make sure the light isn't causing an issue with that. Okay, so yeah, so, um, Joe works in Fall River, and when I get up this morning, usually I get up when he leaves at like quarter of six, but I didn't feel like waking up so early. So um, I stayed in bed for a whopping extra 20 minutes, um, and then I got out of bed, um, I got up and I turned on the news, and they were talking about a car accident that had happened on... 195 and based on the time I was like well because they don't tell you what time the car accident happens so I was like well he should already be like you know past that area and on his way to work um so I didn't really get too too super worried um and then about 10 15 minutes later he sent me a message saying that he was almost in a really bad car accident and he was you know wrote texted what happened so I called him and I was like it's all over the news so I guess he was riding in the middle lane and somebody was in the right lane and there was like a lot of oncoming traffic fast traffic in the passing lane so um he had been trying to get over but he couldn't because there was you know a lot of people were going slow it was raining probably pretty bad this morning and you know the roads were ponding and all that stuff so a lot of people were going very slow in that middle lane so he was waiting so he'd get over, but he couldn't because there was people speeding down the passing lane. So there was this guy or a person, I don't know, in another car um, that was in the right lane and just completely cut Joe off and didn't even look and just went right into the passing lane, um, into incoming fast traffic. Um, got hit and I guess they got like smushed up against the barrier. Joe was, um, he told me it was very loud and there was... Um, car parts going everywhere 
and if they had bounced off of the medium, then they would have hit right into Joe and then Joe would have hit other people. So I am counting my blessings this morning and I'm very happy and uh, grateful that um, he's okay. I mean, it's working all right, but I told him, I said, you know, maybe we should start thinking about moving closer to your work because <laughs> we're a good like 45 minutes away from his work and uh, it's a great job. They are really good to him and he's been there for, I think going on, it'll be six years in February maybe. Um, but it's tough because I'm from Rhode Island, born in New Jersey, raised in Rhode Island. Uh, I've been here since I was three, but um, it, we would have to move to like Somerset, which isn't too bad, but I don't know. We will see. Oh, that is so pretty, guys. Sorry. We are looking at Washi, and I'm talking about Joe's accident, or almost accident, which is on my mind. This is so pretty, guys. Okay. I'm very excited about these. I really love the quality of the Washi. It just feels so nice and smooth, and I love brandy new Washi. And I actually have to look into possibly getting another Washi storage, um for and I get mine I think I got these on Amazon I'm gonna have to double check but I'm pretty certain I did um yeah definitely gonna need another one I cleaned one out and I was like okay I don't use this one I'll use this one I'll use this one so I'm either gonna have to do some more cleaning out or maybe just get another one but I already did that I got a second one and then that one filled up like instantly so I don't know should I clean it out should I get another one it's just gonna get really full but I do have a lot of washi like from the washi tape shop, um, and, uh, Coffee Monster Co., obviously, but I just have so much washi, I don't know what to do with it, <laughs> so we'll see. I actually might get, like, another, I have a jar, um, like a cookie jar, clear cookie jar, glass cookie jar, and I put all of, um, or a bunch of my, um, washi tape from the washi tape shop in there, and it looks really cute, um, but my desk area is a hot mess right now, guys. I'm in the process of like just cleaning things out, decluttering things, um, repurposing things. I've got a bunch of storage and cute gadgets and desk accessories and stuff coming in. So I'm like, I'm in a crazy mess. And I've been filming every time I clean or organize a section so I can put it all together and do like a desk reorganization vlog for you guys. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that. But yeah, I think maybe I'll do another jar. Maybe I'll get like some cute, like those candy jars. That was my fish. I think he's trying to escape. Um, <laughs> I might get some of those really cool candy jars that you see, um, the glass ones. And maybe I'll do like, like a cluster of them or something like on my bookshelf and then put washi tape in there. Like the ones that I don't really use that much, but they'll be decorative. Maybe I can get some neutrals and put them in there. Although I use the neutrals a lot, so I don't know. We'll see. Okay, anyways. Very squirrel today. Sorry. Okay. Super cute. Love those. Need a place to find the, where I'm going to put them. So, <laughs> we shall see. All right. I got to check on the time because I don't want to be late for the dentist. Do okay. it. I'm going to do a separate video on this. Um... Yeah, I'm going to do a separate video on this because it might take me a little bit more than I have time to do right now, but I really want to share it with you guys. So I will, um, I'll do it and it'll probably be a very quick YouTube, but I will do it in a YouTube video and then, um, I'll see if I can also film it, um, and put it up as real on Instagram so you guys can see that too. But I did it with this one. It's so packaging. I forgot what, what it was, but guys can see that so this is not the vellum this was the packaging and I know a lot of people um, in the group were asking how I did it and then they tried it and it came out cloudy um, I'm not sure I don't know if I just got lucky but um, what I did was I took the bag apart so I only laminated the printed part so I don't know if that had anything to do with it so we will do that I think in another video I don't think I'm gonna have enough time to do it today. Or right now, anyways. So let's just check out how this binder is gonna work. I'm gonna load up some of these stickers. Okay, oh, it has a piece of my hair in there. 
So what I want to start off with is the five by seven, the full sheets, because I use those for like um, the back and front cover. So we'll put these on or in. And then I'll do this one facing the back. I might probably, I might change this out a little bit, but I do like how these match. And then we'll put this one in the front. We'll start there. Now these are double pockets. So there is one slit really, but you, well, there's two slits with a divider. That makes sense. Okay, now let's do, do I have any more of the five by sevens? I have mostly these, whoops, half sheets. I'm gonna actually pull you guys up a little bit so we can see that a little better. So we're gonna put these in. I do have other five by sevens. Oh, here we go. I have them. They were blending in. So I'll get all of these in. And I have to do them like individually because I can't see if I do more than like one or two. All right, so we're just gonna, I'm not actually, you know what? I'm gonna load them all in. So I wanna see how it is when it's kind of full. Oh, I'm putting these in backwards, aren't I? I'm doing them all upside down. Guys, oh, okay. <laughs> so, all right, those ones are back in there, good. All right, there's still one in there that's upside down. Pay attention. See, this is what happens. I start talking or I am so busy doing 12 things at the same time that not one of those 12 things actually comes out. You know, good. All right, let's see. This is the one that's upside down, so we'll move this one. I can tell you right now, I'm going to be honest. I like to give you guys my honest review. This um, ring binder is much easier to open and close than the one in the vinyl or um, PVC, whatever this is, the soft clear. This one I kind of struggle with trying to open and close it, um, but it still works. So this one is a little bit easier. I can tell you that right off the bat. All right, so let's load in. Let's do, all right, so this is like Halloween. And then this one is my fall stuff. So I've got two pumpkin spice. So this is how I like to do it. So just pop them in. And I kind of like to have them so they're complementing each other. And then on this side, oops, I put this one in backwards. This goes in this way. And then on this side we'll do, I'm gonna do my Hocus Pocus and the large doodles and put those in here like that. And what I'm going to do here also is put these in the front. Yeah, that's so much easier. I have trouble with these type binders. All right, so because fall comes before Halloween, we're gonna do those first. That can go in the other one and let's put in, oh, I'm so excited for these. We'll put this one in the front. And then on the back side, we will do Halloween. Didn't I have three sheets of this? What did I do with it? There we go, perfect. And then this way I have all of my fall stuff. And then what I think I'm gonna do is, so I do have Christmas and things like that. So I'm gonna load in everything I have for my seasons, I think, in these. So it'll just be my seasonal binder so I can have fall, Christmas, winter, um, spring, and summer. And I will separate it that way in this um, this binder. I think I like that better. And then put my regular kits and stickers um, in what I have already. So I think that is what I'm gonna do with that. And I definitely have enough of these. These come in so you can get, let's see, either a pack of the five by seven. So it's just a full sheet. It does have two pockets. So one in the front and then one in the back. Um, I believe they're $7.99. I can't remember how many come in a package. And then these um, are the half sheets. And these 
these are also $7.99, I believe. And then they do have the quarter sheets. So if you're looking for a smaller storage, which I'm probably going to get because I do have a lot of um, these type stickers, like the samplers, and then I have just smaller vinyls and stuff. But like I said, I might actually use them on the reusable sticker album that I got. So, ooh, that's cute. I like that. And then it's nice, like, frosted cover. Um, and you can put a label on the binder of this. So I think, um, honestly, I think I probably, I might pick up another set. Like I said, it was really good price. It was $10.99 for a set of two. I really like the idea of this. Um, and I feel like, like I said, this is getting a little too too chunky for me. So maybe I could take out like the holiday ones, like I said, and put them in here and then just have like themed binders um, and do it that way. Cause right now I'm using um, tabs from Avery and they just kind of, they stick and like they, they're removable. So it's really great. Um, and then I have them all labeled like, so I have self care and I have planner emojis and functional emojis and adulting emojis. So it's been working really good, but I think to take out some of the bulk in these that I'm going to transfer my seasonal stuff and then maybe um, break it down even further because I do have two, but we'll see. Maybe I'll just switch out the whole system. Um, we shall see. But uh, like I said, everything that I've talked about in this video with these sticker albums will be in my Amazon storefront if you want to check them out. I probably will put them under sticker organization, I think. I don't remember what I have these binders under but whatever I have these binders under I will put this stuff with it um but yeah I like these so far I'm liking these but we'll see okay and then this I'm gonna be using for I think on the go I think that's how I want to use them I want to use them for any stickers I want to take with me when I am gonna be planning like oh, maybe on a trip or something like that I could take I could just throw these two smaller books into my planner, my planner tote, and my fountain pen holder. Oh my gosh, so cute. I'm so excited. Like, yes, I'm obsessed. Hi, I'm Erin. I'm obsessed with the Coffee Monster Co. Glad you're here with us. Okay, so in another video, I will, so today's Friday. This video is going to go up tonight. Um, I will do another quick video showing you guys how I did this um, or how I'm going to make this into a pencil board. So I will either post that tonight and it'll be very short. Um, oh, I don't know, it might be like 20 minutes shorter than what I normally do. Um, or I'll post it first, first thing tomorrow morning. We will see how my day pans out and um, I'm really hoping that I don't have to have 12 fillings because if I do then I don't know if I'm going to feel like talking. So we'll see. Okay, so stay tuned for this. Let me know down in the comments if you're excited. Um, also, um, let me know if you ordered anything from the birthday sale or the pre-order, if you've gotten your goodies, um, and let me know what you got. And um, if you are interested in subscribing to the channel, go ahead and do so now, and then hit that little bell notification so you'll be notified anytime I come out with something new or when I come out with this video showing you guys how to turn this into a pencil board. Um, and as always, thank you so much for taking time out of your day to come and plan with me. Um, I truly, truly appreciate it because I know we're all busy. So thank you. And I'm happy you're here with me. Um, and until I see you again, have a beautiful week and keep planning. Bye.